Hey guys, it's Kevin Lover 8895 here. Um, it's about 11 o'clock at night, and I'm making this video for Baby Husky to celebrate her 25th birthday. Um, I'm sorry I couldn't be there today, Baby Husky, because of um, virus keeping me and Delta away. So, I wanted to record a special birthday message for you. You know, if you and I, have, we've known each other since high school. Basically, the first day we met, we were attached to the hip. Basically, um, we basically grew up together with Kelsey, and we were tight ever since. And some days you make me want to pull my hair out, make me want to scream and yell at you. And then there's times where you're always there for me. You have my back. You always protect me, just like your husband does. <sighs> Sometimes you just make me wanna, uh, <laughs> but we managed to pull through on those bad times. We have our good days, we have our bad days. Sometimes we have our days where we don't even really speak to each other very often because we're both busy with our lives. But I couldn't have a better best friend than you. You always have my back. You always tell me what I'm doing like wrong. Basically, tell me how much of a nun skull I am sometimes, and you always tell me when I'm dating the wrong guy, you always tell me straight in my face saying, You the bad guy, you should break up with him, da 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 da. And half the time, you're usually right. But on days we spent with our friends, like we did that one time we went to Collins, that was fun. That was really fun spending time with you. I really did enjoy that. And. I don't know what I do without you, because when I lost touch with you a few years ago, it broke my heart, because I thought to myself, oh, I'm never going to see my best friend again. Because when you start going to college, I figured, oh, shit. Like, when we graduated from, co from college, I'm sorry, when we graduated from um, high school, I'm saying to myself, oh, fuck. I'm about to lose my best friend, because I didn't think, well... Maybe I should get our number so we can stay in touch. That was my dumb fault. But I'm glad over the years we've reconnected and gotten stronger and stronger. You're happily married to a wonderful man who helps to be my brother. He's an arms goal. And, um, you know, I'm getting married to the love of my life, Eric. Drives me over the wall sometimes, but he makes my heart skip a beat every time I see him. In these next 10 days, without seeing you or Alpha or Delta, Hey, it could be a mess. <laughs> but knowing you and Delta and Alpha, you three will keep me busy. I mean, we'll talk every day. Um, we'll video chat all the time. Um, but I just want to say you make me so happy, baby husky. You're my best, like, I know I keep saying this, but you are my best friend. You're the one who stood by me when no one else did. You understand me when I'm really, really angry. <sighs> You've helped me gotten through these years where I was thinking to myself, oh, no one cares, and blah, blah, blah. But yeah, I mean, we always had so much fun on the LAU fun nights. Oh my god. And my, you was basically the one who got me out of that complete obsession with, well, you know who. But, <clears throat> that should be sailed. My past is my past. My future is coming, and I can't wait to see what the future holds for both of us. I can't wait for you to be there at my wedding when I marry Eric. And then hopefully our, our we will send our kids to the same school, and they'll become friends. And basically my, my kids will be your nieces or nephew, and your kids will be my nieces or nephew. So, can't wait to see what the future holds for us. Yeah, I still have all those pictures on my phone. That's why I can notice I keep looking down. I'm looking at my phone. So I'm looking for some of those pictures. I still have some of those pictures we took from high school. Uh, I think this is, I got a few of them. Oh, I also have some of the pictures that we took when we went to the bar with Jenna. That was really fun. <laughs> I always enjoyed hanging out with all of us. It just made that night really actually made my night. It really did. It was really special. It was fun. 
because that was the night I found out that my Aunt Kitty was close, close to, you know, passing away, and you and your husband were only wanted to keep me on my toes, keep me from, you know, losing my mind with grief. Basically knocked me from doing something really, really, well, basically just got me out of trouble. And most of the time when you told me something about my exes, you were right. Most of them were jerks. <laughs> hmm. But yeah. I'm trying to find that one picture I wanted to put in this video. Give me a minute to find it. Uh, where is it? Uh, oh yeah. Also the pictures we took for our you see those pictures we took? There's you and your wonderful husband. And let me see if I can find that one picture of us. No, oh, there it is. My wonderful, beautiful best friend. <laughs> and you say you're not beautiful. If you ever say you ever say you're not beautiful again, I will come out there and tickle you and make you regret it. Because I do not like when to see my friends put themselves down. You are beautiful. Don't let anyone ever tell you different. You are beautiful. I love you. Hope you have the best birthday ever and I can't wait to see you in 10 days. Once these 10 days are up, the whole gang will get together. You, your husband, my, my fiance, and myself. We'll want to get together and have a nice relaxing day. Um, we'll, I'll make dinner and we'll all watch a movie and relax and just have a good old, good old fashioned time. Like we usually do when we're all together. You know, Eric is on our nerves. <laughs> Sorry, babe. Love you. <laughs> but yeah, let's just say Ellie, you're my number one best friend. Love you. Love you, Corey. <laughs> Alright, guys. Well, I'm gonna end this video here, so... I'll talk to you guys later. This is Baby Husky. Oh my god. <laughs> Brain is losing it. This is, this is Beta. Signing off. Bye guys.